the water level of Lake Yoda was at a record high of 450 feet in the year 2002, but has been dropping 3.3 percent every year since. The Forest Service is concerned that when it reaches the low level mark of 225 feet, they will have to close the lake to public use. They are trying to predict in what year the water level will reach 225 feet if it continues to drop at a rate of 3.3 percent a year. We want to solve the problem following the steps below. We first want to write the function that represents the change in the water level of Lake Yoda since 2002 in the form L of t equals a times b raised to the power of t, where L of t represents the water level of the lake t years after 2002. We'll notice in 2002 the water level was at 450 feet and therefore the initial value which is a in our exponential function is equal to 450. So we know a equals 450 and notice the water level is dropping at a rate of 3.3 percent per year which means r equals 3.3 percent which must be expressed as a decimal which would be 0 0.033. And now because the water level is dropping 3.3 percent each year the base b is called the decay factor which is equal to one minus r. So b equals one minus r, which is equal to one minus zero point zero three three. So the base is zero point nine six seven, which means L of t equals four hundred fifty times zero point nine six seven raised to the power of t. Be careful, we do need to use the variable t because notice how our function L is a function of t. Next we want to write the equation L of t equals 225 that can be used to determine in what year the water level will reach 225 feet. So we want to know the value of t where L of t is equal to 225, which means we want to solve the equation 225 equals 450 times 0 0.967 raised to the power of t. Now for our next step, we want to isolate the exponential part of the equation, then rewrite the exponential equation as a logarithmic equation. So we want to isolate 0 0.967 raised to the power of t. To do this, we'll have to divide both sides by 450. And 225 divided by 450 is 0 0.5 or one half. So we have 0 0.5 equals 0 0.967 raised to the power of t. Now we're asked to write the exponential equation as a log equation. So looking at the two equivalent equations below, one in logarithmic form and one in exponential form, we want to go from exponential form to logarithmic form. To do this, we need to be able to identify the base, the exponent, and the number. So notice in our exponential equation, the base is 0 0.967, the exponent is t, and the number it's equal to is 0 0.5. So the log equation would be log base 0 0.967 of the number 0 0.5 must equal the exponent t. To enter this online, you do want to use the equation tool by clicking in the answer box and then clicking in the small yellow arrow that will appear to the right. We want to enter log base 0 0.967 of 0 0.5 equals t. And now we're asked to rewrite the equation using the change of base formula given here below and we'll use the common log which means t is equal to the common log of the number 0 0.5 divided by the common log of the base 0 0.967. And again, we do want to enter the entire equation, so we have again log 0 0.5 divided by log 0 0.967. Again, these are both common log equals t. And now for the last step, we want to solve the equation for t and complete the sentence below. We're asked to round to the nearest year. So now we'll go to the calculator and evaluate the quotient of these two common logs 
to approximate the value of t. So we have the common log of 0.5 or 0 0.5, close parenthesis, divided by the common log of 0 0.967, close parenthesis and enter. So the nearest year, we would say t is approximately 21. So t is approximately 21, but notice how we're asked to enter the year in which the water level would reach 225 feet, not how many years it would take, which means we have to take the base year, which if we go back, was the year 2002. So we need to take the year 2002 and add the approximate value of t, which is 21, so the year would be 2023. So if the water continues to drop at 3.3 percent a year, we would reach 225 feet in approximately 2023. I hope you found this helpful.